welcome back. I'm Claire. This is Purple Poppy. And today we are on Coffee Break Crafting. So this is where we make a quick project. Now, today I'm going to do a double belly band with a sliding element. So, I've got this image. Now, you can use, obviously, any papers that you choose. I'm using these because I love them and they're already printed out, so it makes sense. So, it's probably going to take me a little bit longer than you because, obviously, I've got a fussy cut shape on here, whereas you could just be cutting a relevant size piece so i'm using four books i've decided i'm going to use four of these books okay. and this is what i'm saying i need to fussy cut this edge now this is only copier paper so i am going to stick it to card which again means it's going to take me a little bit longer than it would take you if you were using, you know, a scrapbook paper of some kind, or if you'd printed on a thicker, heavier paper than I have. So, trim these out like so. Okay. I'm going to stick it on here. So it's stronger. As I say, you wouldn't necessarily need to do this part. I'm going to line it right up to the edge. Okay, and I'm going right across the middle. And while I've glued to the edge, I'm actually going to turn it over and turn down a small area like that. Okay. Like so. Then I'm going to lay it back down. I'm going to trim down this line. Now, I do need to tell you that I will only be doing the Thursday Coffee Break crafting videos now until the new year. In the new year, I will be also doing the Tuesday, oh, the Tuesday, the, oh, the Tuesday journal videos. That I was doing before but there is just so much going on at the moment and I think you're probably all way too busy to consider starting a new journal so I think it makes sense just to concentrate on coffee break crafting so that is our first belly band that's going to go on the back of our page then what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut a strip. <coughs> Sorry. Sorry, postman. Boo doesn't like the postman. <laughs> um, I'm just going to cut one of these strips off of this witchcraft do you do um, bits and pieces sheet. And this is going to form my second belly band that's on the top um, because obviously it's going to sit on top we do definitely need it to be narrower and marginally longer so I'm not cutting off that white bit I'm just folding it over at the top and at the bottom okay so I folded it over because it's marginally longer, it will stick on the page. Yeah? Okay. 
but we do need to glue it so onto here for strength so i'm just going to mark a point there we're going to cut that along there like so we are going to slip this hopefully over there hopefully i've measured it right it's marginally too long we'll just take a little tiny bit more off like so slip that yeah that's perfect so now i'm going to glue the back between the fold lines okay we're going to put that on there like like so we're going to trim that now obviously you could ink all these edges up you wanted to spend you know a little bit more time okay so that now folds there that slips over there and now we need our slider so i think i'm going there's a top hat there so i'm going to go for this guy with a flat hat so we're going to cut him out like so. We're going to glue him on as well so that he's a bit tougher. I didn't obviously need to glue all of it because we're going to cut that edge bit off. But hey ho. Cut that off like that. And this is going to be our sliding piece. Again, if you had thicker printed, you wouldn't need to back it. Now, you need to take a piece of card. This is going to be perfect. It overhangs this picture. So I'm going to run glue there and we're going to put that on there like that. Okay, so you've got like a odd shaped cross. We're then going to bend that round and oh, it's not long enough. Right, okay. We need a longer piece. Sorry. <clears throat> Is that long enough? That's still too short. Oh, this one's long enough. Right. So I stuck it to the photograph and then I've placed this down and I've bent that round it and we're going to glue the two tabs together. Make sure that it's not too tight. Make sure you've got sliding room. There you go. Okay. So then what we're going to do is put it in our book. So we find the next page in our book. That's the Christmas one we did last week. That's a bit lumpy and bumpy, so I'm going to do it on this side. <clears throat> so we're going to glue this fold. And we are going to stick that in the middle-ish of our page. Like that. Oops. Maybe not quite like that. Like that. Slide that up out of the way. Put glue on this piece here. Like 
like so. Slide that up under there and press that down like that. Okay, so you could at the moment flip that one up and flip that one up. Yeah. So now what we're going to do is we're going to glue this bottom flap and this bottom flap. We're going to lie that on top of that and then we are going to press them both down together. So now what you've got is a slidey and one, two belly bands. How about is that? For just over 10 minutes. <laughs> that was a super good one. Super quick, wasn't it? I hope you've had fun and you'll have a go and make some of these. Stay safe. I'll see you soon. Bye bye for now.